All right, just started recording. All right, can you do me a favor and introduce yourself? Give me your name, last name, first name, last name, and spell it for me, and your title, please. Great. So, uh, my name is Jeffrey Trageser. Last name is spelled T-R-A-G-E-S-E-R, and I am the Director of Clinical Services with LifeShare. Okay, thank you, Jeffrey. Now, from my understanding, you guys are able to give kidney transplants to 19 people in 48 hours? Yeah, well, not just kidney. Kidney, liver, um, lung, and heart transplants. Um, to, to, you know, got 19 people transplanted in a very short amount of time. So, uh, you know, organ donation is very rare, and there are a lot of people waiting for their transplants, and it takes a long time and a lot of people to do that. And to put that in perspective, we usually do about that many um, organ donors and transplants over the course of a couple of weeks. And uh, we just had a very busy stretch and, and did it all in a very short amount of time. It got a lot of people their second chance at life. And uh, it was quite, quite an endeavor. One second, Jeffrey, I wanna, I wanna pin this. I just gotta make sure I got it. Got it make sure that I don't show up. <laughs> All right. Um, so how did, you, how did you guys make this possible? This is the first time I've ever heard of 19 people in 48 hours. Yeah, you know, it's, it, it takes a lot of, of, of manpower, really. And our team is really what made this special. I mean, it starts with the families of when you, when you lose someone, um, it's, it's so tragic and so sad, but um, a small percentage of people who, who pass away can be, go on to be organ donors. It's not a big, it's like 1% of all, all of us when we pass away, only about 1% of us will even be able to be organ donors. So it's so important when families choose to do that to help other people. So really credit goes to the families who, who recognize that their loved one could save other people's lives. And from there, you know, our team that I work with, um, I'm blessed to work with, you know, just stepped up uh, day after day, hour after hour um, with, with little or no rest to, to try to make this happen and, you know, covering people on their days off so that this could happen. It was, that's really the, the interesting feat that took place. Were all the people, um, were they relatives or, or how do you do the screening process? So, um, for organ donation, so really what we work with is we work with anyone in San Diego and Imperial counties at all the hospitals, there's 27 hospitals. We work with the families who are losing someone in the hospital. That's our connection. Um, we talk to them about organ donation. We, we, we provide them support and then we, we manage um, to find the recipients. Now, how do we find recipients is really set up by the United Network for Organ Sharing. We don't pick, we don't pick those recipients. They're matched in a computer system and it's based on their size, their blood type, their age, um, lots of different health characteristics factor in so that the sickest person at the top of a list, whether it's kidney, liver, heart, lungs, the sickest person who is the best match is going to be able to get that organ um, and have their life saved. And it's an algorithm that's worked out, but so we don't actually have any say in picking who gets which organ. We just work with the families to honor that gift that they want to give. And how does the DMV um, help you out with that, with the organ donation donor thing? Great question. So when you go to the DMV, um, they will ask you if you'd like to be an organ donor. And that's a way that you can tell your, your friends, your family, your loved ones that, hey, when, when my time is up and I can't use my organs anymore, I would like someone else to be able to use my organs. Um, and you can do that at the DMV. You can do that online too. You can go to donatelifecalifornia.org and sign up yourself. And it's connected to the DMV either way. But you don't have to wait until you need to renew your license. You can do it right now. Okay. That's good to know. Um, is there anything that I missed that you want to tell me? No, I, I think I just want to, you know, let the people of, of San Diego know that, you know, we're working day and night, um, do everything we can to get people off the transplant list. Because when you need an organ transplant, 
um, the clock is ticking. It's very difficult. It's scary, as you can imagine. And, and to, to know that there are people out there trying to, to help you uh, get your transplant, I think it's important. And, and then we will do everything we can and go the extra mile to make that happen. This is really great thing you guys are doing. Okay, and then um, let's see what did I have more? I don't think I have any more questions. I thank you. Uh, um, yeah, that's it. Okay, well that was easy. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Jeffrey. All right. Wonderful one. Bye bye. Yeah. That's yeah. it. Bye. It is.